Hey, we're back. See, let's not die and cry at the same time. We're going back to the second floor. Well, the area between the second and third floors. Candy cane room. Wait, can I do this again? <gasps> Can't. Maybe it's because there's Russia and in the group. Russia and Canada. Maybe because it's already broken. Steve's gonna come and eat us all. I don't know what this is. The paper hangs on the wall. It reads, Wounded and feeling tired? Nothing better than a nap in a good bed or splashing water over your face. Ads. I hate them. Hey, people. We're back, Italy. Oh, you're back. Hello, er, Japan. Italy, thank God. You seem to be doing a little better, as does your memory. Yeah, sorry for all the trouble. I still don't remember everything, but things are falling into place. I talked a lot with my brother, so I've started to remember things little by little. Oh, you're back. The food will be ready in a moment, so you can sit down and wait. Thank you. Lily, do you have a minute? Yeah, sure. You see, I've been holding on to a letter just to you. Read out loud, please. For me? Yes. Do you remember what happened in this mansion? Yeah, about half of it, I guess. And I'm a little scared. All the more reason for you to read it. I haven't read it myself, but I'm sure you'll find it helpful. It's my handwriting. To the me who lives at some point in time, and who isn't alone, to me who lives at some point in time, and who isn't alone, once again I made some mistakes and also some progress. Meanwhile, I'm fine. I finally, but slowly, began to learn to rely on my friends. I was constantly afraid that everyone would blame me for dragging them into this, and that they would hate me or be appalled at me or get mad at me and leave me. But then I was told that I had the wrong idea. They were very mad at me. It hurt so much. Not that they hit me, but it really hurt. I finally figured it out, but I can't pass this memory on to my next self, unfortunately. I'll lose my life yet again. That's why I'm writing a letter. Say thanks to England. And tell them the truth. I'm sure they'll get mad. But it's not that they hate you or think you're in your pain. Why didn't you rely on your friends sooner? What friends for? That's what they told me. And that's what they're going to tell you too. I'm sure I'll cry. And then... And then... Italy? What? I've been thinking all this time, wondering what we're going to do now. What do you want to do? Er, investigate some place, or... No, 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 I meant once we get out of here. I've talked about this with Russia, and about how we should have a party at my house, or something like that. Wasn't it a party at Charna's place? At your house? That sounds like fun! I also have to work till late, so everyone should arrive late at night. I'm sure we'd all be tired, so I think we should sleep soon afterwards on that day. I have a kitchen garden. I could get up earlier than usual the following morning and go there to pick vegetables. Hey, that's a nice idea. I'll try to get up early and help you too. <laughs> Thank you. Then, when we come back from the garden, we'll make breakfast. That's my cue. America can wake up those who are still sleeping. Yes, and then well, maybe we could all go out somewhere. Let's go to the, what you call it, the amusement park or something. Well, I suppose I can refrain from hitting on everyone at least for that occasion. I'm sure a day or two wouldn't be enough. Oh, yes, we could go shopping. Yes, I suppose I'll, I'll take a look at the suits. 
I went to a place to wear a while in my Japan's place. What was it called again? A yukata? Let's all buy one. I can hardly wait, and when we go back to my house, we'll all have a banquet. With a lot of food from all over the world. Let's see, what should I make? Um, well, I'll make pots, pasta and pizza. I'll contribute with beer and worst. And then we'll all sleep together in a huddle. Then I'll lay out the futons in the other room. You can, all, you can go to sleep whenever you like. Sounds interesting. Hmm. What should we bring as a gift? Maybe you should send it beforehand, don't you think? The Benziano? Yeah. We'll bring the best ingredients. Lots of them. I'll bring the beer. <laughs> it'll be fun. Really fun. That's why, Italy. Yeah? Let's put you off to escape without everyone who is here without losing a single person. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure I'll cry. And then, and then, look around yourself. Ah, that's right. I... I have many friends. It's close to me all the time. Italy? Why are you looking down? Do you still feel unwell? No, I'm fine. There's something I want to tell you. Ah, I can't. Where are we going to do, Romano? What the hell are you going on about? I forgot to tell Austria and the others that we found it's a... <laughs> Is he coming too? Wait, the others? You mean almost everyone who came to the world meeting? Romano threw a fit back there. He was really desperate to save his brother, you know? I'd never seen Romano being that honest before. Shut the fuck up, Bastardo. What's wrong with with swallowing my pride to save my brother? <sighs> yeah, you're right, brother dearest. Romano, thank you. I just want you to come back. I don't want you to go through that again. Since you fixed the time quite a bit, our friends also work really, at least a little, right? Good timing. I'm sure we'll be able to hear their angry voices even from here. All right, we'll watch Spain get an earful of it. <laughs> oh God, Romano, can't you answer it instead? Just answer it already. Okay. Hi, long time no see. Yes, long time. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Well, um, I'm really sorry. I forgot to call you. Huh? I was with Romano and er, um, yes, yes, there are amounts of the mountain of things I want to say to you. Or a lot more than a mountain, actually. When Romano didn't contact us, I was worried sick, you fool. Huh? Roma? Idiot. Italy, you can hear me, can't you? Come down for a bit. Look outside from the window. What? Uh, okay. Wait, don't go by yourself. Let's all go together. Hold on. Don't walk in the front. You're being targeted, aren't you? Come behind me. Yeah, let's go quickly, or else he won't stop Bitching. Then again, I don't think he'll be able to see us very well with all those bars anyway. <laughs> Wait, do I go on the first floor or the second floor? To the first floor, I guess. Not now. What? Where do I go? Do I. Oh, here. What? <laughs> this again. No, this is sadness. Huh? What What are you looking at, France? Really, I've heard that of what you've done to some extent. Not very laughable, was it? I I'm sorry, but I just... You're far from being a fool. You're an outright idiot. Do you have any idea how worried Romano was? Hey, you don't have to go that far. Oh, keep talking. Hit Italy. Take a look out. Ugh, I knew it. They're mad at me. Well, of course, it's my fault. Oh. Everyone. Italy. Y yes? I think they're all on the second floor. What about the first floor? Jeez. Y yes? I don't approve of your idea to try to solve everything on your own. However... You really did your best. Huh? 
the whole or the whole world has come to help you, but unfortunately, you couldn't find a way to get in. We'll have to support you from the outside, however frustrating this may be. Whoa, those over there are the Nordics, and over there are Ukraine, and even Belarus. Scary. Everyone. Amazing. We really have to get out. Get out. Get out all together. I. Yes. I'm all. I'm alone. Indeed. You should broaden your horizons. Also, you should come home soon. The cakes are getting cold. First, you have to come out safe and sound. We're also doing everything we can here. It's rather uncanny. Everyone are greeting, greeting so much with one another. It's a unity warning. <laughs> It's true, we can never get anything done together when we have a meeting, and yet now we've started to work together. Well, of course, even though we fight and get don't get along, we're all fellow nations. You're right. Yeah. Still haven't gotten some of my memories back. Still, I can already answer their most important questions. Guys, sorry for making you wait. Veneziano. I'll tell you everything. Everything I remember. Italy. I'll tell you everything from the very beginning, so this could take quite a while. Still, I want you to listen. It's about time. Go ahead and tell us already. And don't hold anything back. It'll be a quiz. I've been waiting to hear that, Italy. Wait, isn't this about the time where... Please do tell. We want to know the extent of it. Thank you. Let's see, it all began shortly before the world meeting. It happened to overhear some rumors, and that's when the clock hands began to move. Chapter 11, take us back. There are 17 and a half chapters in total. And then I'll possibly replay Head to Only 2, if I really want to. I don't know much. No, I don't know, maybe. Well then, I'll go back for now. If anything comes up, call me. Okay, be careful. Well now, or, well, where should I start? What do you want to hear? Well, um, this isn't the first time we came here, is it? Ah, uh, I was also wondering about that. America said we've gone through this several times. Uh, yeah, we've gone through this several times. Ever since we came here from the world meeting. I knew it! So what happened the very first time? How this started, okay. His eyes are gone at the moment. Before the world meeting, I sneaked away from Germany's training and arrived at an unknown city somewhere. When I was there, I happened to hear rumors about this place. I thought it sounded interesting, and I told America about it. Yeah, no difference so far. Yeah, oh, but the very first time I came here with nine of you. Just everyone except me in Spain. Just be, this is really the first time we both are here. We were just going to have fun. We were going to go home soon. We opened the door and came in, but as you know, there was that monster inside. We all ran in different directions, and I got lost from everyone. We were so scared and had no idea what happened. I wanted to find someone as quickly as possible. After walking around a lot, I found Japan. I was really happy, but he had just been beaten by the enemy. Until then, I'd completely forgotten that Japan had come along. There was a gap, as if something had been erased. While I was thinking that there was something wrong with my memory, China, Russia, France, America, Canada, and England killed one by one. By the time I'd finally be able to, to escape, Prussia and Germany were also killed, and I was the only one still alive. You were alone. I was supposed to get out. But I felt too hopeless. I just wanted, I just wandered around without knowing what to do. Before I knew it, I was in the library. That's when I found this book. That's the Bible you've been carrying all around, well, been carrying all along, isn't it? Yeah, it kind of looks like a Bible, but this is a, actually a journal. When I opened it, I had the names of it. it had the name of its previous owner written on it. It reads Rizu no Ko, right? Everyone had died before my eyes. I was all alone. By then, 
I wasn't really thinking straight.